Well, Bandy, a 4 1 victory against Cheltenham Richard this afternoon. In your opinion, was the win as, as emphatic as the scoreline suggests? Yes, should have been more. A bit disappointing to let them score in the last minute, but after the last two performances, um, great win and a great performance by the lads. What pleased you most, the scoreline or the performance? The performance, the you lads coming in doing a great job. Um, Sid coming back in, give Danzi and Mendy a bit more freedom, but from the lads starting the three subs that come on, everyone put the performance into this. Another quick start, wasn't it? But how do you set the team up ahead of the game? But we just thought we needed to freshen it up. City's come in, done a great job and give her, like I said, Danzi and Mendy a bit more freedom. Danzi was amazing today, wasn't he? Especially from set pieces. Everyone was on the bottom on it. I said, straight in from there, we could have had a couple more goals. Uh, played at highest level, so you expect that often. We were two goals up at Longridge, not so long ago, of course. What do you think the difference was today? I think learning from defeats like Longridge. Uh, we set up a bit different off corners, so again, it's having pride in keeping a clean sheet. That's why I'm disappointed personally with conceding the last minute. Well, obviously, Eddie Mitchell's brace that almost calmed the nerves down, didn't it? Yeah, like I say, it's for us. It's getting the three points here. More, we've got to get the wins away from home. It's great on here, and again, another game on there Tuesday night against North, which will be another win. So, hope the fans were there for that one. After the fourth goal, you made all three substitutions pretty much at the same time. What was the rationale behind that? Four, you four up, take people off, get people more minutes. So like 25, 30 minutes left. Um, and save people for Tuesday. To what extent do you think we've set a benchmark now? I just said that in there. You set yourself as a standard now. You can't drop all men away. Now, everyone ran and the tripe off today. We've got to do it again Tuesday, training, away next week at Winningshaw Town. But they've set their own marker today and they've got to not drop the line. I guess it proves the point that they can do it, they can shut teams out, they can press the ball. So, in some ways, there's no excuse now, is it? No, like I say, they're dangerous. We've got Brad Carls in, John Dar up top, and we kept them quiet for the, until the last kick of the game. So, it's there, it's now take into the away games. As you've alluded to, it's a quick turnaround now, isn't it? But a great platform to build from ahead of Tuesday now. Yeah, let's, all, let's rest up and enjoy the weekend and get ready for the derby match now. It must be 10, 15 years since we played Northwich in the league game. Um, let's have just got to rest up now. Big game again Tuesday. Thanks so much, Bandy. Thank you.